today's video is going to be a makeup look, but it's going to have a little bit of a twist. Basically, it's my everyday makeup, but I've written it all down on a piece of paper, chopped it up and put it into a hat, and it's going to be determined by whatever order I pull out of the hat. So I'm just going to put my hair up and then we'll get into the video. Okay, let's see what's first. So, first is going to be bronzer. I might pull them all out first, see what order they are, and then do my makeup because then I'm not stopping and starting. Okay, so first we've got bronzer, then setting spray, then we've got blush, foundation, primer, highlighter, lipstick, powder, eyebrows. Eyeshadow and mascara. Okay, so let's do it. Oh, I'm scared. So, first we've got bronzer. So, for bronzer, every day I use the Bourjois bronzing powder. So, we're just going to take that on a brush. This is the Nude by Nature powder brush. And just I feel like if I put a lot on, by the time that I put my foundation on, you'll still be able to see it, hopefully. So, that's the aim. Okay. Next, we've got setting spray. So I'm using the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea 4-in-1 Setting Mist. Next we've got blush. Taking the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12-hour blush in the colour Thrilled. And I'm just going to add that to my face a lot too. So that by the time that I put the foundation on, it won't look as gone. It'll still look like it's there. So excuse me for a little while while I look like a clown. Oh my god, I look really sunburnt. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Now it's time for foundation. I'm taking the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop in the colour... Light porcelain. I'm just going to pump that onto the back of my hand and then use my beauty blender to blend it in. Okay, now that that's all blended in, we're going to be going on to primer. So for primer every day, I use the Angel Veil by NYX. So I'm just going to put that onto my hand. And we're just going, I'm just going to rub that into my fingers and then rub it into my face. Oh. <laughs> this is disgusting. Okay, so that's completely mixing in with the foundation. I feel like if I tap it, maybe it'll save the look. 
mean, I doubt it. But it could. My face feels really soft though. So now that the base is completely disturbed, we're going to go in with highlighter. The everyday highlighter that I use is a Physician's Formula. I don't know the name of it. Natural Nude, I think. I just take a mixture of the top colours. <coughs> and put it on. going to be doing lipstick. So the lipstick I'll be using is the Tarte lipstick in the colour Naughty Nude. So next is powder. Let's see how well this goes. I'm taking the Fit Me, uh, Maybelline Fit Me in the colour Fair Light and taking my Too Faced Teddy Bear Hair Brush in the powder brush. We're just gonna tap it into the skin and hopefully that fixes everything. I don't know if you guys can see how much the base has been disturbed, like, on camera, but in person my face just looks all over the place. <laughs> so apparently I left a couple things in my hat so after mascara is going to be eyeshadow primer and then after eyeshadow primer the last step is going to be concealer. I can't believe I left things in my hat. I didn't even realise because I can't see the hat properly, like the bottom of the hat from here. So, didn't realise. Okay, so now we're doing eyebrows. So, taking the browsings by Maybelline in the colour 3. I'm gonna go do that off camera. Okay, so my eyebrows are done. They're not looking that great, but they're not horrible. Okay, so next we're doing eyeshadow. So for eyeshadow, I'm taking the Tartlet in Balloon Palette. And for my everyday makeup, I usually just pop this shade here, which is Flower Child, all over the lid. Then Sweetheart in the crease. And then sometimes I pop Funny Girl in the inner corner of it. So I'm going to do that. So now as mascara, I'm taking the Caviar Total Tease. I've only used this one a couple times and the wand's a bit funny, but I like it. So I'm going to kill my lashes and then pop that on. This is what the wand looks like. It's like, I don't know if you can see it properly, but it's like a bristly on one side. And completely flat on the other side. Nothing there. But then there's like a little bowl kind of thing. On the end. Sorry, it's not really focusing, but yeah. Eh. It is like in my eye. And then I use the little weird bully bit to do the bottom lashes. I think it's meant to get clumps out, but. It works really well on your bottom lashes, so that's what I use it for. And then just doing the same on the next eye. <coughs> so I always find it really easier 
when I'm doing my mascara to use a really little mirror. So that's that's what I'm doing. I think it was eyeshadow primer next. So we're gonna do that. And then we're gonna do concealer because I know that was also the other one. So I'm taking the lemonade by Benefit and putting that all over my eye where I've done my eyeshadow. <laughs> So this eyeshadow primer is really, really good at just making everything all the one colour. So it's gone now. <laughs> and the other side. Okay, and then next, or last, is the concealer, and I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape, and I'm just going to pop that under my eyes, down my nose, on my forehead, any blemishes. Now to blend that in with a beauty blender. Oh, it's not blending properly. Of course it's not. <laughs> God, it's like uh, I don't know if you can see it. Probably not, but it's like dried in a clump because there's powder under it. <laughs> and then under the eye. At least that brings some highlight back. Yep, that's dried funny too. So, it's really, really bright under my eyes, and I think that's because the um, concealer didn't have the chance to blend in with the foundation. It just sits on the powder, which is a look, but it's really, really bright, and I, I don't like it. Um, no point at all of putting the concealer, uh, not concealer, ew, it's clumping no point in putting the eyeshadow on either so we just put the primer right on top and I couldn't set the primer either so it's all clumpy and gross um there's also I don't think you can see it on the camera but there's also like a big clump all here of where I put the concealer and that is <laughs> because it's clung onto the um, powder. It's happened everywhere. So it's happened on my nose and on my chin and under my lips, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Um, comment down below if there's anything that you'd like to say or any videos you'd like to see in the future. And don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this and other fun videos as well. Thanks for watching guys.